Imagine a future where some airplanes can be controlled from cell phones, or cars get 100 miles to the gallon. That future is already here, as demonstrated at Aviation Unleashed, a conference in Hampton, Virginia, sponsored by NASA's Langley Research Center and the National Institute of Aerospace. The event worked to bring visionaries and entrepreneurs together to paint a picture of what kinds of surprises aviation might have for us by 2050. What would they be surprised to learn? Woo! <laughs> that! <laughs> they will be surprised to learn new technology such as unmanned airspace systems. Um, it's going to be exciting. I mean, wouldn't you love to have that in a larger size that you're inside and can fly around in? That could be our future. That could be sitting in your garage. For now, that quadrocopter is primarily a toy. The Parrot AR drone equipped with four rotors, a camera, and Wi-Fi that can be flown from an iPhone or iPad. But some NASA engineers and students are using the aircraft as part of their aeronautics research. One popular vehicle at the conference wasn't an aircraft at all. It was the automotive X-Prize winning Edison II very light car that can travel 100 miles on one gallon of gas. The automobile has some things in common with an aircraft. It's designed to be very light and very aerodynamic. Um, in fact, we have some really good aero people on our team. Some future aerodynamicists also gave conference participants a look at their vision. Students from the University of Maryland's Morpheus Lab showcased flying research vehicles that flap like birds.